Alright, Bocce's back with another battle spot battle against Cole. I'm gonna lead off with my shift tree. He's gonna lead off with his Greninja. Uh, this is a focus hat sh shift tree. I'm gonna go for the fake out just to get some chip damage and hopefully break any type of sash there is. He's gonna go for the predictable ice beam, playing it pretty safe, hitting me with the super effective move because I'm a grass type. It's gonna bring me down to my focus sash. I am going to hit him up with the stab leaf blade. Uh, Greninja is not the bulkiest of mons, so um, he he lives with one HP or about that. So I'm gonna send in my slow king to take it, whatever type of attack. This is an assault vest one. Uh, he goes for the nice and safe night slash to finish me off, or what would have been a finish off. Now he's gonna go for a uh, toxic, so I can't try and stall him out. I'm just gonna go ahead and finish him off. There's no reason to keep a Greninja around with the speed and special attack stat like he has. So I go ahead and knock out the Greninja. And my opponent is going to send out his Gengar. So Gengar's gonna come next. He's gonna just go ahead and try and take me out with the Shadow Ball. Between that and the toxic, I should go down really soon. I hit him up with that stab side shock, should do a good amount of damage to him. Actually, takes him out. It's not a focus dash game, but thankfully. Those are quite annoying, especially with their destiny bond. Uh, the toxic is going to go ahead and bring me down. So, I'm going to. He's going to send out his Rayquaza. I believe I'm going to send out my Slacking. Go for that life orb. I, I believe I'm running life orb this time. Be um, I have facade, retaliate. Uh, I don't remember what else I'm I want to say either fire or ice punch. But, uh, go ahead and knock out that red plaza. Oh no, he's got the focus edge. That's right. The second time in my entire career playing Pokemon. I ran into a dang Focus Sash Mega Rayquaza. He's gonna go for the, um, the Dragon Dance. I don't have to worry about that because I have the fake out. The only thing I have to worry about is if he's running the same speed or not. So I can't risk my ship tree going down. So I'm gonna leave my side king in to go ahead and fake. And then just pray that he's not running the same speed. Surprise! He doesn't have any speed, so fade out. Not to not, and I go ahead and 